What's up guys, Average Tech Guy here, and today I'm back with a kind of a follow-up, update, review type thing. Um, iPad Pro 11. Got it right here. My iPad Pro 11 is my daily everything. It's my tablet, it's my phone sometimes. It does everything, right? It's my entertainment source. And you know, I have been having an issue with lag on the screen with a tempered glass screen protector. Everybody's been having it. And we've addressed it with some case companies. Some have said they fixed the problem. Some said they can't fix the problem. Some said they working on the problem. Okay, so apparently there was an update and let's see, 12.2. This update was supposed to actually get rid of the actual screen lag issue. So when I heard about that, I said, okay, I, I like my screen protector. I need one. I went out and I bought another one. Skin on me, the tech glass. The one I did a long time ago, the one that's oleophobic, the one that's shatterproof, the one that is probably one of the best ones I've ever worked with. I've used skin on me on my phones, on my tablets, on, on everything I've had before. Now, great company to work with. I put this back on my iPad Pro 11. So let's let's just dive in. I'm gonna put it down, I'm gonna change the camera angle. We, we're gonna see if we get that lag back. If I do, I'm gonna be upset this time. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna be mad. I'm probably just gonna get up and walk off. So here we go, Skin On Me Tech Glass is on. It's on my iPad Pro 11, this is 2018 version. Um, I got it on here. You may be able to see it, you may not be able to see it. You can definitely tell from up here though, right around where the camera and the monitors are, you see that you got the screen on there. So we know screen is on, everything is supposed to be a go. Let's do this, finger test. So there seems to be no lag at this point. Um, that's a good thing. The pencil never had an issue with lag, really. It never really had a big issue. Case off, there never really was a big issue with lag on this. Out of box, Symmetry Series 360. Now, this is a shell type case and it has to snap in. Now, here in lies where the issue came in at. Most of the issue was because these shell cases actually touch the edges of the screen. So all the way around, these shell cases are actually touching the screen because the screen runs edge to edge. Let's get this going. Got it all. So maybe they did fix the lag issue. Maybe the software update that came out was able to correct what the problem was. There we go. So I'm having no issues with lag right now. The update, the 12.2 update, seem to have fixed it for the time being. Now, I'm not saying that this is a permanent fix. I'm not saying that this is the permanent solution to our issue, but as of right now, I don't have any lag on this screen. As of right now, like I said, I'm not getting that lag. This is a shell case, as I, as I mentioned. I'm not getting any lag issues. So I'm really hoping that this is going to be our fix. I'm hoping that this is gonna work. I'm hoping this is able to help someone out. Let me know, drop me a note in the description, leave a message. If you do have a screen protector and you have updated to that 12.2 um, iOS, drop me a note, leave me a message saying, hey, it does work or it doesn't work. But until next time, hope it does work, hope it helps. Give me that thumbs up, please subscribe. Average Tech Guy out, peace.